What's up, everybody? Steve OFS here. How are y'all doing today? I am doing fantastic as always. You guys know me. Always fantastic. Well, guys, I just figured I'd, uh, in front of you guys as a care and, uh, we're wondering about my boy. He had his little, uh, surgery. He took it like a champ. He's doing good. He's happy. He's smiling. He loves his daddy. He's a good boy. <laughs> yeah, so everything went good, guys. He's um, doing great. Took a little longer to get the surgery actually started when we got there. Uh, poor little boy couldn't eat for fucking almost all day because he wasn't allowed to eat before it. And then, you know, until he got done with the surgery, the surgery didn't get, got pushed back to almost four o'clock. You know, when it was supposed to be in the morning, I guess uh, the doctor said the previous patient um, didn't want to wake up. Didn't want to wake up from the surgery, you know? <laughs> hey, yeah, it's cool. You're the doctor doing my son's surgery and your past patient didn't want to wake up? Did they wake up? I'm just saying. A little bit of a little bit of worry, but I do like his, uh, his surgeon and doctor. Uh, seems like a good guy. So he's, he's done most of the work on my boy and He's done a good job so far, and uh, I was nervous, I was scared, I was terrified. You know, you had to put them under, and kids don't usually do too well going under. They don't want to wake up. I, I was just a little scared, but he did He did good. A boy did good. He wasn't fussy, crying, or anything. He's just like, hey, hey, Mom, Dad, how y'all doing when he got out? The, the boy is awesome. He is freaking awesome. Oh, we're gonna get stuck behind the. Oh, we're gonna try to make it. Hey guys, mowing some grass and and shit. All right, where was I? So yeah, he, he's doing great, guys. Uh, happy little booger, uh, doing a great job, healing up great. He's got another appointment in like four or six weeks or something like that. Uh, he's still got to get uh, some kind of two pulled out and they got to pull out through his penis which I really hate the poor boy he's always getting things pulled through his goddamn penis uh, that's the one thing that drives me crazy but hopefully it works saves his kidneys and uh, he has a healthy life and grows up to be uh, strong and kind and a good man and your fearless leader that will conquer the world and rule you all with an iron fist but he will be kind because he's my boy. We're rough around the edges. We may seem like assholes, but when it comes down to it, we're there to help. Let's get on the road. There's a bug in my helmet. Right in my eyeballs. Right in my eyeballs! Well guys, I won't keep you any longer. I just wanted to give you a little update on my boy, your future leader, ruler of this world. Uh, he's doing great, healing up great. He should be good uh, to take over the world. <laughs> All right guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to thumbs up. It uh, helps the channel out and I do appreciate it because you guys are awesome, each and every one of you mofos. And if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that little bell so you guys will be notified when my fantastic videos up. Because they're fantastic, goddammit. Yes, they are. I guess I need to stop at the red light. All right, guys. Well, I got to go and get some uh, air in these tires. I didn't do the last time I rode, and they are bad. So, uh, until next time, guys. As always, peace, love, and unicorn. Steve, out. Bitches.